reported today in The Verge. Uber is making big changes to its app in California as new gig work law goes into effect. Uber is making serious changes to its app in California in an effort to comply with the state's groundbreaking new gig work law that makes it harder for the company to classify drivers as independent contractors. On Wednesday, Uber emailed over 150,000 drivers and millions of passengers to alert them to the changes. The app will now display prices differently, allow users to select preferred drivers, and discontinue some benefits associated with its Uber Rewards program. The company is betting that by giving drivers more control over their rides and making fares more transparent, they can avoid some of the repercussions of the law, which enshrines the so-called ABC test for determining whether someone is a contractor or employee. But it could also result in more rejected trips for passengers. Uber, which has hemorrhaged money since its disastrous IPO last year, is dead set against classifying drivers as employees. In its email to riders, Uber warned that new state laws could end up hurting passengers. These changes may take some getting used to, but our goal is to keep Uber available to as many qualified drivers as possible, without restricting the number of drivers who can work at a given time, the company wrote. We want your Uber experience to be excellent, and fewer drivers on the road would mean a more expensive and less reliable service for you. Passengers in California will now no longer see upfront pricing for all trips other than Uber Pool. Instead, they'll get a range of prices. The final price will be calculated at the end of the trip based on the actual time and distance traveled. Previously, if the fare estimate was too low or too high, Uber either rate the difference or pocketed it. That resulted in situations where a passenger might pay $20 for a trip, for instance but a driver received only $10, angering drivers who shared such examples on social media. Passengers can also add drivers to a list of favorites, giving them priority to accept future ride reservations. Drivers who are given a one-star rating won't be matched on future rides. The company is also discontinuing some Uber rewards benefits, like price protection on a route and flexible cancellations. There are big changes for drivers, too. Drivers will now be able to see more trip information, like a trip's time, distance, destination, and estimated fare ahead of time, before accepting a ride request. They can also reject a request without penalty. This could lead to more frequent rejection of shorter trips that drivers determine aren't worth their time. Drivers could also refuse to accept rides to certain neighborhoods, which could lead to discrimination against lower-income areas. A spokesperson for Uber said the company is monitoring the situation. For more on this story, visit the news article link.